the KSU Stadium here in Manhattan, Kansas. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Kansas State is getting fired up down there as they get ready to boot this opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. With the pass incomplete. From their own 25-yard line. Second down. Strike to his receiver, no good. the 45 a good play fake that time here the play action was key to held the linebackers there by the fake by the running back and the running back did a very nice job of carrying out his fake well, the defense has to be very frustrated there they did everything they got to the quarterback in fact it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack but somehow he was able to throw the ball away it's second and ten ball on the 45 Hit immediately. Got it. And he goes down quickly. Jones picks him up six yards with a catch. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Room around the corner. He's taken down at the 31. I like how efficient the offense looked on that play. Everybody knew their assignment, and it all came together for a nice run. First and 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. Catches it, and he's looking for more. He's out of bounds at the 34. the stop the 37 yard line that's a gain of three on the play third down so it's third down now and they're going to need about four once it all going deep tipped away Gammon was the intended target so that'll make it fourth down it was a good hold by the defense on third down. That now their punt returner point. will get a chance to make something happen. Young awaiting the return. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Young takes it the 15. He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. For a nice game. That's a gain of four on the play. That makes it second and six. Mike three, Mike three. And he's taken down at the 35. I credit the quarterback on that pass. He made a great read and delivered a very nice pass for the first down. And he 
he's tackled at the 36 yard line. That's a game of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. And down he goes at the 45. Nice job here by the quarterback of putting some air underneath this pass and letting his receiver catch up with it for a nice game. Nice run, and he's brought down. That's good for a game of five yards. That makes it second and six. Throws it in a hurry. He's tackled at the 39. The reception. That's a gain of 11 on the play. First down. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 39-yard line. Tackled outside after a nice pickup. Gain of five on the play. That brings up second and five. a loss of about five. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that one. They'll call on the field goal unit. Rutgers is looking to go up by three. It has the distance, and he just drilled it from long range. Kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. And he's taken down at the 29. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. He's out of bounds. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 45. Down at the 45-yard line. Second and inches. Tight end right. Tight end right. Four down, four down. Mike eight. Mike eight. Hey. Red and five. Run. Tackle made at the 47. Call a loss of two yards. Third down. So it's third down, and they've got about two yards to go. Scrambling around, and they got him. He has one job on passing situations, get to the quarterback, and he did that job very, very well on that play. Young is back awaiting the punt. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. The Scarlet Knights really taking care of business early in this football game. Yeah, somebody forgot to tell them that they're the big underdog in this game, and they're supposed to lose. I love their confidence that they're playing with right now. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Rutgers holds a field goal lead. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Set, 
There's a strike complete. And he tackles him hard at the 23-yard line. Fires it out. They'll bring him down at the 30-yard line. Number 15 on the tackle at the 30-yard line. That makes it first and 10. And now he's got room to run. Makes it out to about the 43. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. First down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Tackle at the 46. Patterson on the tackle at the 46-yard line. First down. I got one. I got one. I got one. Hey, let's get some penetration here. Red check. Green nine. Tiger. Green nine. Steps out of bounds at the 43. Gain of three yards. Coming to you. Coming to you. That'll make it second and seven. Quick throw. He's taken down right around the 32-yard line. That's good for a gain of 11 yards. Here's the eighth play of the series. Rutgers is up a field goal. He steps up the 26-yard line. Gain of six on the play. That'll make it second and four. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. This is the 10th play of this drive. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Quick out to his receiver. That's a great tackle at the four. Parker makes the tackle at the four-yard line. That makes it first and goal. Quick throw, and he stopped behind the line. That's a loss of about three. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. We're at the 12th play of the drive. To that quickly, and he is drilled at the two-yard line. That's a gain of five on the play. That makes it third and goal. Mike three. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. to perfection for the school. It's a great job by the quarterback to read the defense. He made a nice pitch to the running back and let him go in for six. And he converts the extra point. So a 13-play, 78-yard drive, and the result, seven points. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. So the score now... 10-0. The Scarlet Knights have found a way to shut this offense down, but hey, it's still early in a football game. Yeah, give them a lot of credit for the way they've played up to this point, but just based on watching these teams and preparing for this game, do not be surprised to see this offense eventually find itself and start to execute much better. Fires out to his wideout, and they make the stop around the 30-yard line. Number 26 on the tackle with the 30-yard line. That brings up second and five. It's second and five here. Ball on their own 30. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. Call it a gain of three yards. 
That'll bring up third and two. Makes it to the 35-yard line. From their own 35-yard line, it's first down. And he's taken down at the 38. Number 12 makes the tackle at the 38-yard line. That'll make it second and seven. He's met immediately. That is a loss of three yards. That brings up third and ten. And here's another third down. Quick pass. He tackles him for a loss. Loss of three yards on the play. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. And he's hammered down. We're through one quarter. The Scarlet Knights with a 10-point lead. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set to start the second quarter. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. He fights forward to about the 33. That'll make it second and seven. And he's tackled at about the 49. Call it a gain of 16 yards. First down. Got it to the senior. And down he goes at the 43-yard line. They pick up good yardage that time on the pass play. Here they kind of put pressure on the quarterback and challenged him to find the hole in the defense. And in this case, he did. Nice job. He fights forward to about the 43. He's going to air it long. Incomplete. Almost picked off. Jones was the intended receiver on the play. That'll make it fourth and two. Trying to change the field position with his kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. And he's tackled right away. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Off play action. Now he's on the move. He takes off, decides to slide. bring him down in the backfield. Well, I think it's safe to say the defense had his number on that one. It can be very frustrating for a running back when he stopped before he even gets going. From their own 42-yard line, second down. And he's going to lose big yardage. 
He's tackled immediately after the catch. Makes the tackle at the 35-yard line. That'll bring up third and long. He's got to throw it in a hurry. He goes downtown. Big catch there as they knock him out of bounds. You know, I think that time, Brad, the defense tipped their hand with the blitz. You could really see the blitz was coming. And when an offense at this level knows that there's pressure coming, they can make the proper adjustments and then put those wide receivers in one-on-one -on -one opportunities against the defense. And when you blitz, you're really leaving yourself vulnerable to a big play against a good offense. Gets out to about the 25 yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. That brings up second and nine. Second and nine. Ball on the 25. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good for a gain of five yards. That'll make it 35. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Nice play to set up first and goal. Here they go. First and goal, down by a couple of possessions. He's into the open field. Makes a move, and he's in for the touchdown. He kept it himself and created the whole thing with his feet. Boy, was that fun to watch or what? Here's the extra point to draw within three points. He makes the PAT. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Rutgers is up by three. He makes his way out to about the 35. Game of 10 yards. That'll make it second and inches. Five wide. Nice run there. Call it a gain of six yards. First down. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Toss across the middle, and he's level at the 48. Brooks, back to return it. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick, hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. This quarterback right now is in a rhythm, and a lot of that has to do with his preparation. You can see right now with the reads that he's being able to make, getting the football out of his hands, that he's feeling very, very confident in his ability to throw the football against this defense. Looks like he's going to run. He's tackled at the 33-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 33. for a loss. Gilbert, the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up second and 11. Here we go, here we go. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. My gate, my gate. 
A little misdirection. And they hit him in the backfield. Loss of four yards on the play. Makes it third and 15. It's third and 15. Ball on their own 28. Throws in the middle. Brought down at the 40. That's a game of 12 on the play. That brings up fourth and three. Young will be the return man. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Young takes it to 15. He gets hit out of bounds at the 23. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Rutgers has a three-point lead. Slings it. Tackle made around the 32-yard line. Gain of nine on the play. That makes it second and two. He's hit and taken down. Gain of four on the play. That makes it first and ten. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Fires that quickly, incomplete. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Second down, ten yards to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. Wants to throw outside. Finds the junior. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown, Rutgers! Great effort by the wide receiver. And not to take anything away from the quarterback, but the wide receiver made this play. Well, that'll go down as a pretty long pass play, but he's got his playmaker to thank for doing most of the work. And he adds the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. The ball is loose. The defense scoops it. What was most impressive is how he followed the play and he just didn't give up on it. It was that effort that allowed him to come away with the fumble. So the question here is whether or not his knee hit the ground before the ball came out. So a big momentum shift could be in the making here as we take a look at the possible fumble. After review of the play, the ruling on the field is reversed. So after the review, they reverse the call on the field. Double tight, double tight. From their own 16-yard line, second down. Mike eight, Mike eight. Oh. Grabs it and hammered right there. Young awaiting the return. He really got a hold of that one. Young fields it at the 37, tries to get around the corner, and he makes it out to about the 47-yard line. The Scarlet Knights are just cruising through this first half, Herbie. Really a comfortable lead here. Yep, but still a lot of football left to be played. they got to remember that it's a four-quarter game, and even though that first half went pretty well, things can change in a hurry. 
in the shotgun and five wide outs. Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. He's knocked out of bounds. Right around the 40. That's good for a gain of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Here comes the pressure. He's at the 30. That's a great tackle at the 22-yard line. That's a game of 18 on the play. First down. And he's going to be sacked. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. That'll make it second and one. So the sack makes this a second and long. Throws complete and he's hit right away. Number 56 on the tackle at the 22-yard line. That brings up third and 10. Screen pass. He's got his half back. They'll bring him down at the 10-yard line. The middle linebacker came on a blitz, which can be very disruptive. Sometimes a quarterback will get happy feet when they see that coming. But not this guy. He's very composed and can deliver under a pass rush. He's got it with room to run. Out of bounds at the two-yard line. A gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. So it's second down and about two yards to go. It's our time. It's our time. That's 22 by 22. Here we go. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. That's his second touchdown of the day. This guy has great vision out of the backfield. Even if a hole isn't there, he's patient enough to wait for one to open, and then he hits it. And he hits the PAT. So a seven-play, 48-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. They line up to kick this one away. Excellent kick. This one's going to be down to the end zone for a touchback. It's still only the second quarter. We've got a lot of football left, but I've got to say, this one is teetering on the brink of a blowout. Throws and it's incomplete. incomplete. Mouse was the intended receiver on the play. From their own 25-yard line, it's second down. Here's the throw, I don't think he got anything on that. The Scarlet Knights are going to call their second timeout. Got the corner. And he's taken down at about the 39-yard line. The Wildcats will use their first time out of the half. Complete across the middle. He's taken down at the 49. Kansas State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. First and 10. Ball on the 49. It's a bad play overall by the offense. The quarterback's doing everything he can to be able to make the play work and try to execute. The problem is the offensive line did not do a good job protecting him. They're very fortunate that ball wasn't intercepted. He's on the run. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And down he goes at the 23-yard line. Easy, easy, easy. Buffalo, Buffalo. Three, check three. Ready. He's going to try and scramble. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Easy, easy, easy. Stingray. Stingray. Here we go. 
Now he's scrambling. They bring the quarterback down. Wildcats using their third and final timeout. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Kicks away, and he just drilled it from long range. I have a feeling this ball is going nowhere near the return man with this kickoff, most likely to end the half. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The offense really came up with a nice drive there last time out, and most of those yards came through the air. This defense needs to improve from front to back. The line needs to put more pressure on the quarterback, and the defensive backs need to stick it to these receivers with tighter coverage. We played a half. The Scarlet Knights lead 24-10. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. No impressive rushing numbers in the first half. Both teams continued to try to establish the run. They were very stubborn about it, though neither one was very successful. We got the sense at times that it was a little predictable, that maybe the defense knew exactly what was coming every time. The run game is extremely important. It's important because it's body blows to a defense, and you loosen them up, I think, later in the game. It opens it up to play action. But that doesn't mean that your script goes, first and 10, I have to run the football. Mix it up. Keep them off balance. Keep the defense guessing. You've seen across college football, the teams with the most balance seems to be the most successful offenses. I can only hope that Nestler and Herb Street will bring the same type of intensity to their call of the second half that David and I have brought to the halftime show. Of course, they always do. That's it for us here in the studio. Time to get you back out to the guys for the second half. And we welcome you back to the action here. Just about set for the second half. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And they make the stop at the 28. Gain of three on the play. That'll make it second and seven. Second down, seven yards to go. Ball on the 28-yard line. Tackle at about the 37-yard line. Gets rid of it. Man left, man left. From their own 37 yard line. Second down. Ready. Three, and they get nice yardage on that run. the sack Loss of one. that brings us fourth and seven young is back to receive oh excellent punt He makes it out to maybe the 23-yard line. They're set to go for another round. Gets it. He's in space. 
And he's tackled at the 36-yard line. Gain of 13 on the play. First down. He's tackled at about the 45. Jones on the tackle at the 45-yard line. That brings up second and one. Throws quickly, and it's almost intercepted. Well, the offense catches a break here. That ball should have been intercepted there by the safety, so the quarterback gets the ball back here for this next down. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. He's under pressure, and he throws it away. So that'll make it fourth down. On third down, the defense was expecting the pass, and they defended the play very well in the secondary. Brooks is back deep to return the punt. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. They were forced to punt the ball away the last time they had it. They'll be looking for a little more out of their offense on this possession. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Thompson with the play fake. He scrambled. And he dives forward. A good quarterback knows when and how to improvise. And if he's got the skills, he can also turn a scramble into something big. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. That reception good for around four yards. It's a nice pickup here, although I'm sure they'd love to get their receivers into a little bit more open space downfield. Brought down to 39-yard line. And he gets a yard on the run. That'll make it third and five. From their own 39-yard line. Third down. There's a strike complete. Tackle made around the 43-yard line. Gain of four yards. That'll bring up fourth and one. The defense has everybody on the line. I think they're going to come after this one. Booming kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. He's under some heat. They'll bring him down around the 38-yard line. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it second and two. Run there. The Gain of six on the play. That makes it first and ten. Fires quickly and he's got his man. And he's taken down at the 46. Number 20 brings him down at the 46 yard line. That'll make it second and inches. He's taken down right around the 34. Sullivan makes the tackle at the 34-yard line. First down. Mike three. Mike three. And down he goes right around the 20. I'm not sure what happened, but one of the players is hurt. First down. From the 20-yard line, it's first down. Green and eight. Green and eight. 
Makes it to the 11. That's a gain of nine on the play. Let's go. That brings up second and one. Strike to the receiver, touchdown. And did that play ever develop nicely? Well, it's all about the receiver on this play. He beat his man off the line and then ran a perfect route. All he had to do after that was make the catch. And he tacks on the extra point. So that's an eight-play, 80-yard drive, and the result, seven points. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. So our score, 31-10. The Scarlet Knights continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. The offense is looking to be a little bit more successful with this drive as they had to punt the ball away the last time they had it. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up to capitalize on this possession. That makes it second and six. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 29-yard line. The Scarlet Knights lost a player to an earlier injury, and unfortunately, it doesn't look like he's going to be able to come back today. Delayed handoff, and he's not going to get back to the line. Third down. Right, tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. Mike eight. Mike eight. And he's immediately tackled. From their own 35 yard line. First down. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. Call it a gain of three yards. That makes it second and eight. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. Well, the defensive backs completely jumped the run. Only the run was never there. It was just that misstep that allowed the completion. From the 45-yard line, first down. He's scrambling. And they make the stop at the 40. That brings up second and five. Big opening. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. After a decent run up the gut. Call it a gain of four yards. That makes it second and six. This is the ninth play of this drive. Four down, four down. Mike eight. Mike eight. Let's go. Three, nine. Man wide open, in and out of his hands. Third down, and they need to get it to the 24. right around the 16-yard line. Here's the 11th play of the drive. He fights forward to about the 13. Gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Second and seven. Ball on the 13. Runs it, and he 
stop short of the line of scrimmage. No gain on the play. That makes it third This is the 13th play of this drive. Under heavy pressure. Tipped away. That's a really athletic play when you're right at the point of attack. You don't have a whole lot of time to react, but he moved very quickly and he got his hands in the way of the pass. So it's fourth down. This isn't much more than an extra point. It's up and it is good. Lynch is lined up to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Kansas State's been throwing the punches, and they're all landing right now. You're telling me, Brad, just an incredible effort in all three phases, and they're sitting on this comfortable lead with a quarter to go. The last time out, they were able to pick up big chunks of yards through the air. You wonder if they'll go back to that same strategy, or will they start to lean a little bit more on their ground games? It's complete, brought down, nothing doing. Well, the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack, but somehow he's able to throw the ball away. From their own 25-yard line, third down. And a quick throw, and he's tackled around the 27-yard line. All the game of two yards. That makes it fourth and eight. Brooks awaiting the return. He makes it out to maybe the 43-yard line. So at the end of three, the Scarlet Knights lead 31-13. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. We're about set to start things up again. Scrambling around. The quarterback scramble gains three yards. From their own 46-yard line, second down. And he goes down quickly. Game of six yards. That'll make it third and one. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. My gate, my gate. Now he's scrambling. He's tackled right around the 38 yard line. From the 38 yard line, it's first down. The 30 yard line. Call the game at eight yards. That'll bring up second and three. Side right, side right. Four down, four down. My game, my game. Let's hurry. Let's hurry. Rose quick to the receiver and it falls incomplete. Now is the intended receiver on the play. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. Now is the intended receiver on the play. That brings up fourth and three. Tight right, tight right. Four down, four down. 34, eyes on 34. My game, my game. Ready. Put on Philly. 59. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. 
He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. the 42 yard line number 20 makes the tackle at the 42 yard line that makes it first and 10 gets it out to his receiver in a hurry tackle made around the 46 yard line number 20 with the tackle at the 46 yard line first down He gets to about the 34-yard line. That's a gain of 12 on the play. First down. Roger, Roger! Mike three. And he's stopped behind the line. Third down, and they need to get it to the 24. Mike three, Mike three. Bumble, bumble, bumble. Here we go. Go, go. Over the middle to his tailback. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Loss of three yards on the play. That'll make it fourth and 14. Kick is up, and he got it. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 24-yard line. And here we go with the offense, ready to get things going again. Mike eight. Mike eight. Pass complete and taken down immediately. That makes it second and six. From their own 28-yard line, it's second down. Now he tries to buy some time. Slides down to the ground. And he has a huge gain. And I like the decision-making ability of this quarterback. He looks and looks. He sees nothing. He didn't get rattled. He sees some green in front of him, and he takes off. Ends up with a great run. He's going to try and scramble, and they get the sack. Boy, this pass rush is sometimes scary. They're really getting after the quarterback now. That'll bring up second and 15. It's second down, 15 to go. Ball on their own 34. He's on the run. They'll bring him down around the 40-yard line. Call it a gain of six yards. That'll make it third and nine. hit and taken down. That was a good pass and catch there, but still not enough for the first down. That's not an easy conversion here on third down for the offense. All the defense has to do is stay back, keep everything in front of them, come up and make a tackle. And this is what power football is all about, folks. Thompson off the fake, and he hits him hard at the 47. Well, everyone was covered, so he took it himself for the first down. This guy is fearless. He'll put his head down and take a hit, too. He doesn't care. From the 47 yard line. First down. Let's go. And he 
tackled right away. And this is the eighth play of the drive. And he's taken down at the 27-yard line. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. to make a nice catch. He made a really good move at the line of scrimmage. Sometimes all you need to do is throw off the defender's timing just a little bit at the start of the play. Tenth play of the drive. On the ground, right side. That's a great tackle at the 14. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. That brings up second and nine. From the 14-yard line, second down. Let's go! He scrambled. He's taken down at the nine. We're at the 12th play of the drive. Just under three to go in regulation. Throws to the receiver, got it for the touchdown. And he adds the extra point. and breaking that tackle. What a hit. And what a game it's been for this quarterback, Kirk. Well, I think the great thing that he's been able to do is spread the football around. It's not just been one receiver. And when you can find more receivers, it makes it much easier to move the ball down the field. He'd love to keep the offense rolling along here and get even more separation. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. At the 34-yard line. That's good for a gain of 12 yards. First down. From the 34-yard line. First down. They come out in a five-wide set. Nice run, and he's brought down. Pacheco gets about four yards on the play. Kansas State will take a timeout. That's their first of the half. Fights forward to about the 29. The Wildcats call a timeout. That's their second of the half. From the 29-yard line, it's third down. Gets it out. He's met immediately. The Wildcats using their third and last timeout. Just under two minutes in the game. Kicks up. And it's good! Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Brooks needs to return. Brooks fields it at the one. And down he goes at the 25-yard line. The Rutgers, they're really getting after the quarterback tonight. This defense has had success getting after the quarterback. All the good plays from this defense has helped them into the lead. The offense will be hoping they can move the ball as well as they did on their last drive. As long as this quarterback has time to throw, then you can guarantee that he'll find the open man. Got it and brought down immediately. That brings up second and five. 
The spike will stop the clock. From their own 30-yard line, third down. He throws it. And that one's incomplete. Was incomplete. Gill was the intended receiver on the play. Man left, man left. Fourth down. Four down, four down. My game, my game. Let's check, check. Patriot, Patriot. Wow, what a battle and what a stop right there. Congratulations to that defense. That's going to be the ball game. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. A conversion there could have really helped them, but it just wasn't to be. They picked up three points on their last possession, and they've got great field position to work from here. Just over a minute left. Makes it to the 21. Call the game of nine yards. That brings up second and one. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's good for a gain of five yards. First down. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. The quarterback takes a knee, and that's always a good sign if you're a fan of this team. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game, Rutgers 37, Kansas State 20. The Wildcats 20. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.